Hi guys. Uh, so, as I promised earlier, uh, this video is in continuation of our what if analysis, and uh, we are again going to upload this second video, which would uh, talk about this uh, goal seek feature, right? And you can go uh, to my YouTube channel, and uh, you can actually. Uh, check out the videos on this playlist what if analysis or you can go to the excel videos and you can check the video number uh, I guess it's 79 and uh, you can uh, check the what if analysis video over there uh, right now you don't see any video over here because of the fact that it is still in the process of uploading but by the time uh, you reach out to this video definitely it will be uploaded there so this is the second part of uh, what if analysis uh, goal C and today we have a different exercise watch that video the previous one the part one because it talks about the basic one and now we have actually going uh, little you know uh, to the upper side and we'll try to do something uh, more fascinating and more advanced so uh, I have prepared uh, this uh, table for you we have the items here we have the selling price and cost price and I have used the formula called the you know selling price minus cost price and here I'm getting the profit right uh, so now what exactly uh, you know uh, I would say that the that's a gain right so now what exactly we want to do is uh, in order to uh, see that you know uh, that if I want to gain let's say thousand rupees a thousand dollar from here right uh, maybe two thousand dollar then uh, what exactly should be the changes in my this cost price or selling price so for now let's keep assume that the selling price is like you know this is uh, the constant let me just put it in the correct format and uh, so you have there uh, $900 and $44 and the 675 dollars so what exactly you want to do is uh, you want to you know uh, take your this gain to the next level and I want to imagine that if I want to get a uh, let's say a gain of 1475 over here right then what would be my this selling price right so how you can do it you can actually go to the goal uh, you know the seek feature and uh, under this data tab just go to the what if analysis and click on the goal seek and set sell your this to uh, d2 and to value so what you want to do is let's say you want to get the benefit of 1575 dollars right so by changing sell you want to change the selling price so cost price of the item a is two hundred dollars so what if I want to get the benefit of you know the gain of 1575 so what should be my value you know how um, on what amount I actually should I sell this item a so that you know when it it is going to compare with the selling price a uh, cost price of two hundred dollar I should get the benefit of this you know the gain of 1575 so just click OK and this is how you see that the current value is your 1575 uh, which is as you can see here 1575 and this is what exactly it says so that's how you can actually use the uh, you know uh, this uh, selling price you know so you can so uh, if you if you sell this item at 1775 dollar you'll get this you know the benefit of say 1575 right similarly you can uh, do uh, one thing uh, you can even play around with the cost price as well so what if you want to let's say in this tab you want to uh, get the benefit of uh, let's say uh, $400 right so in order to get the $400 you go to the what if analysis go to the goal seek feature and set sell this 221 and right here 400 right so this is what I actually want the gain should be 400 but this time I'll change the selling price uh, not the selling price uh, I beg your pardon but the cost price so selling price would remain 675 but I want to actually reduce my cost price so what I want to do is maybe I would like to negotiate with the dealer from where I'm purchasing that you know uh, because 675 is a very competitive uh, price and uh, I really have a lot of competition in the market and some people are you know selling their the C item at the same very price 670 dollar maybe 672 675 676 so I really don't have any scope but what I can do is maybe I can take the you know amount in the bulk and I can go to the distributor or the manufacturer and I can you know uh, tell that you know I need these many of uh, items all together so um, what exactly the price you're gonna give me so you can you know always do the calculation so by keeping the 400 this price has to be 275 so you can negotiate you know on the 275 dollars you can take the amount uh, the items you know uh, the b in bulk and you can convince them that you know you can you would like to take this kind of a uh, you know you want to settle this on this 
number which is 275 dollars right so by reaching to this 275 dollar ultimately you'll end up getting this 400 dollar so that's it for now i hope you like this video and uh, this is uh, the video number uh, this is the video on the gold seek and i guess this is video number 80 and uh, i'm going to upload couple of more videos uh, part c i'm going to upload very soon this is the part two actually and uh, watch out for the part one as well in the playlist excel or the gold seek uh, what if analysis playlist and that's my email id if you have anything uh, you know troubling you just let me know about it and i'll go ahead and upload the video so i hope you like this video and do subscribe to my channel and uh, share this video with as many people as you can guys and spread the information spread the knowledge and get the change in your life thank you so much Bye bye